Okay, in this video, we want to factor this expression right here. And in the description box of this video, there are two playlists. One playlist has different strategies that you can use to factor, and the other playlist has uh, practice problems. Um, so let's begin. Now, in this particular problem, I'm going to solve it mentally using the trial and error approach. So here we have a 10x squared. And there's a couple of ways to get 10x squared. You could get it by x times 10x. You could also get it by 2x and 5x. And this method is, you know, the trial and error approach. So let's just try something. Let's just try 2x and 5x. Okay, next we have a negative 10. So we need to think of two numbers to multiply to give us negative 10. We have 1 times negative 10 and the reverse. The reverse meaning 10 times negative 1 and uh, 2 times negative 5 and the reverse. So we got to try something. And with practice, you'll be able to spot it more easily. Uh, but for now, let's just try, I don't know, uh, 10 and negative 1. And then we'll see whether this works or not. So 2x times 10 is 20x. 5x times negative 1 is negative 5x. And 20x minus 5x is 15x, not negative 21x. So this is a bad combination. Next, we can try making this into a plus 2 and this one into a negative 5, and we'll try it. So 2x times 2 is 4x, 5x times negative 5 is negative 25x, and negative 25x plus 4x is, in fact, negative 21x. So this right here is correct. Next, we can expand just to prove it. So we can do 2x times 5x, and we would get... Um, 10x squared, we could do 2x times 2 and we would get um, 4x. We could do negative 5 times 5x and we'd get negative 25x. And lastly, we can do negative 5 times 2 and we would get negative 10. And we can see if it matches. Negative 10 matches, 10x squared matches, and 4x minus 25x is in fact negative 21x. So this is correct.